Today, I went to a community sale and an estate sale, and my finds were pretty good. First community sale of the year. Let's see what we picked up on the other side. Let's get those finds. Okay. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, it's good to know. I'm glad you asked in case somebody else wants it. Okay, you, where's his ladder? Right here. You got him? Yeah. I didn't, it was falling off. I'll be, I'll yeah. Yeah. Okay, let me go There's the a ladder. You got all the hats? No, I got a lot of them, though. All right, 50 yeah. for oh. everything. 50? Yep. Okay. The next day. In this busy cell right here, I just picked up a box of Wii stuff. Um, this wasn't a crazy deal. 130 for two Wii's, all the games and accessories. And then down here, there's a bunch of clothing. Nike, some of it's new with tags and it's been, it's Dutch soccer. So I looked at a couple comps. It looks like they're selling for like 30 to $40 a piece for the new ones. So I think I'm gonna be making out with just the clothing for my money back and then the rest will be profit. So hopefully it pans out. In that sale right there, kind of hard to see. Let me zoom in. In that sale right there with the boxes, I just picked up a box of RC cars and everything. Uh, there's a Ferrari, there's other things. They're mostly new bright. New Bright is a bolo to be on the lookout for. Sometimes these race cars can go for hundreds. I don't know if I have anything special here, but um, should be doing pretty well. I just want to say that it was a pretty slow community sale at this one. There's a lot of people set up and everything, but uh, today it seems like it's not as many uh, sales or it's not as many good stuff. So I, I mean, I must have hit like 50 sales already and it's, um, it's 10 a.m. in the morning, so uh, I, I didn't get that much stuff, but I am happy overall that I've managed to get some stuff. Um, everyone was asking for, for video game stuff, so it is really cutthroat out here. Like Everyone is looking for the same thing, so unfortunately, I didn't get too many video game stuff. I, mean, I did find some Wii's, but that was pretty much it. Um, but overall, I'm still happy. I'm still going to be able to make a profit. Let's go over what I got and how much I'm going to make on the pickup recap. See you guys over there. Good morning, guys. Hopefully, you guys are having a nice day. First community sales, a very exciting of the year. So I wanted to go over that. But first, I want to go over the estate sale. I had some pretty good pickups. So at the estate sale, random stuff advertised. I, I wasn't originally going to go. It wasn't a great, fantastic advertising for it. The pictures look kind of dull, but I just went just to see what I can find. And I'm, I'm actually glad I went. So at the sale, they were asking $5 a piece for hats. And it was a little bit expensive, but the lady cut me a deal and I'm overall very happy. So for everything and the overview you're about to see, I paid $50. Found seven hats, an Oregon Nike Windbreaker, and also a Steinbeck Nutcracker. If you're not familiar with that word, Steinbeck, word you want to look out for when you're looking at Nutcrackers. The Steinbeck tend to do a little bit better. Most other Nutcrackers, and I was surprised this was still there. I, I did a couple of complete walk-arounds around the house, like two or three, and this was still there, so I picked it up. It was pretty cheap too. So like I mentioned, $50 for all that, very happy with that. Find, uh, if I sell the Nutcracker by itself, it should give me my money back and I'll be in the profit. I like money. And then we get to the community sale. The community sale was crazy. There was three happening at the same time. Very difficult to decide which one to go to. There was a little, one a little bit farther away. Maybe in hindsight, I should have went to that one because I've been to this one many, many times, but I'm still glad I went to the closer one to my house because I found some pretty decent stuff. Found two Nintendo Wii's with two Wii controllers and six games and also two yeah. games Oh. Mad Cats controllers that were wireless. Also found a Nike KNV soccer shirt, some new with tags, a Ralph Lauren polo, and lastly a USA Storm Fit. Also Nike Made in USA shorts that I've already sold for $30. Happy with that. Paid $130, so I know that's a little high, but just selling the video game stuff or some of the clothing on its own, actually that Storm Fit jacket can sell for upwards of $80. So if I sell that, and I've already sold a short, I'm almost my money back right there. Money, 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 money. At another sale, I found some new bright Nyko and miscellaneous remote control cars, and also found a Radio Shack RC car, all for $35. Offered 20, he was gonna remove a couple of remote control cars, and I said, you know what, I'll pay you $35. Um, if you're not familiar with New Bright, New Bright tends to be pretty good. Just depends what model and what it looks like and the condition and all that. So, should be doing very well with the remote control cars. <laughs> 
Last two sales, this one's an underrated sale. Bible Stories Volumes 1 through 10 for $5, and also a Sony Vaio laptop for free. So $5 for everything you saw in that overview. Yes, the laptop was free. I walked into the sale and asked her how much she wanted for the laptop. That was really the only thing that was interesting in her sale. And she said, you know what, take it for free. Some people just want to move stuff. And I was very surprised that she gave me to that for free. Who knows if it works? I have no idea. I did see that for parts and I can get about $20. So if it doesn't work, hey, it's free $20. And then also the Bible stories I did want to mention is a hidden bolo because a lot of people tend to overlook that. If you have volumes one through 10 older model, like this one was 1975, they sell for a lot of money. As the recording video, I just sold that Bible story set for $94.99, which is a crazy flip for $5. I gotta have more. Happy overall with my first community sale. Wish I had a little bit more video game stuff, but hey, beggars can't be choosers. And also, I don't wanna be a one-trick Nancy. If, if I was a one-trick Nancy, I wouldn't have made any money this weekend. Take your gains when what's there. So I did find a couple of bolos and I was very happy to pick them up. You're not always gonna be able to find what you want at garage sales, but take advantage of what sells and what you've learned and you should be doing pretty well. How are your community sales going? Have you found anything good? And if you did, let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching. Remember to comment, like, and subscribe for more videos and follow my Instagram at Grimsy Reader. Thank you for watching and we'll see what I find next. Thanks guys.